my channel today I'm here with a new video another declutter video today we will be going through my concealer collection and keeping some concealer and throwing some out so this will be a very quick and straight to the point Before video we get started I would like to mention today's sponsor today's video is sponsored by Salon Depot they were nice enough to send me over this amazing steamer that I cannot get enough this has to be one of the best face steamers that I've tried like this thing is really amazing it has a removable top and it has up to 17 minutes steam time a lot of steamers that I've tried out in the past usually steam for about eight to ten minutes and sometimes that's not enough time sometimes I want to relax and sit in front of a steamer for about 20 minutes 17 minutes of steam time in a consistent temperature control of 40 degrees to avoid potential harm caused by too long steaming time or a high temperature with the steamer it does come with some tools for your facial and also you can remove the top this is a nice steamer and it looks so loves this looks like this would be at least two hundred dollars but you can pick this up from Amazon at an affordable price I will have it linked below so definitely go over to Amazon and click the link below if you would like to try out this amazing face steamer I will highly highly recommend that you steam once a week with the facial steamer and this one will just be perfect so go over to Amazon and check out this uh, king steamer but anyway y'all let's just get right into today's video as you see I don't have nearly <laughs> um, as much concealer as I do foundation just because I'm super picky about my concealer and maybe out of this whole entire pile of concealers I maybe probably only use about a good six sixly in this video I'm just gonna do two piles things that's going in the trash and concealer that I will be keeping so the first concealer comes from Tom Ford. This is the Shade and Illuminate Concealer. This is not like one of my favorites, but I do use it sometimes to um, spot conceal. So I will be keeping it. Um, and the shade I have is 6W1 Spice. This shade is very close to my complexion. I rarely use this um, as an under eye concealer. Next concealer is this New Sticks um, New Fix Cream Concealer. This is a pretty decent concealer. I have a review of it up on my channel. Um, I don't use it at all, so I am going to get rid of it. Next concealer is this YSL Touche Eclat High Cover Radiant Concealer. I'm definitely keeping this one. Next is this Clayapo, um Concealer. This was actually sent to me. I'm keeping this one and I um, have a couple shades, so these two I'm definitely keeping. Next concealer is this Urban Decay Stay Naked Correcting Concealer. I've had this for a while, so it is time to get rid of it. Next concealer is this LYS um, Triple Fix Full Coverage Brightening Concealer. I have a review up of this on my channel. Um, I don't really remember exactly what my thoughts were on the concealer, but I do know this is one that I don't use that has just been sitting, so I will be getting rid of it. Concealer is the Huda Beauty um, Faux Filter Concealer. This is pretty new to my collection, and this has been the concealer that I cannot stop using, so I'm definitely keeping um, this. Next is this Say Concealer. I don't like this. I don't even know why I still have it. This is definitely going in the trash. Next is this One Size Turn Up The Base Concealer. Um, I actually did like this, but I don't use it. Um, I'm gonna set this to the side and see. Do I want to keep it or do I want to trash it? I don't know. Next is this Morphe um, Filter Effect Concealer. This is a pretty affordable concealer. I actually like both of these a lot. I will be keeping these. Next is a Born This Way Multi-Use Sculpting Concealer. Um, I don't like this. It's a little too full of coverage for me. So I will be getting rid of this. Next is this Lancome um, Tint Idol Concealer. I don't use this under my eyes. I always use this to clean up my brow, so I'm keeping it just for that reason. I have another Morphe Concealer. This is the Hide and Peak um, Concealer. This was pretty decent. I actually liked it a lot at one point, 
but I don't reach for it and I don't see myself reaching for it anytime soon so I'm going to get rid of it. Next is this Clinique Even Better All Over Concealer. I think I might have reviewed this a while ago. It's a nice one but I don't reach for it and I don't see myself using this one either so I'm going to get rid of this one as well. Concealer I have is the Pat McGrath concealer. Um, I might keep this. I'm gonna sit this with the one size concealer because I'm not sure about it. I've been trying to use this a lot more lately, but I'm still not like in love with it. Like I don't think it's all that great, like how everybody claims that it is. Next is this KVD. Um, I think this is the Good Apple concealer. I think that's the name of it. I'm gonna keep this one because I actually really like it. Um, next I have. Um, two Givenchy concealers. Y'all know this is one of my holy grail concealers. This is not going anywhere. And this will be my second holy grail concealer. The Armani Luminous Silk. I'm keeping it. Y'all know that already. I have the Dior Backstage Concealer. I have the shade 4W5N. I actually have two um, 4W. This, these two I'm going to keep and I think this one I'm going to give away because I opened this and I swatched it. I don't know why I did that when I already have the shade. So I'm going to give this to somebody in my family or somebody at work who actually might want it. Next I have the Anastasia Beverly Hills Concealer. This is another one that I always use to spot conceal with because the shade is very close to my complexion. And there's no way I will use this as an under eye concealer so I will keep the, um, this one just for that purpose. Next, I have the Chanel Concealer. I don't know the name of it, but I'm definitely getting rid of this. This is a concealer that I just do not like. I feel like every time I use it, my under eyes crease right away. I just don't like it. I tried. This is going in the garbage. Um, I have the Dior Forever um, Skin Correct Concealer. I've had this for a while. This is going in the trash. Um, I have two YSL All Hours Concealer. I really like these two as well. I have two shades and I will be keeping this one as well. Lastly, I have the Hourglass Vanish Concealer. I think I'm going to trash this one. Um, I really love the shade of this, but this is one that it just creeps on me a lot. Like, I love the shade of this. I have the shade Maple, but outside of that it just creases a lot so this will be going in the garbage so these are all of the concealers that i'm keeping and these are the ones that i will be definitely throwing in the garbage and this one i will be giving away um that is it for today's video hopefully you guys enjoyed it and most importantly don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see y'all later Bye.